Hi, Skag Stars. It's Miss Walker. We are going to talk about how to check out library books this year. Until everything goes back to normal, we are going to have no students coming in the library to make sure everyone stays safe and healthy. The way we are going to do library book checkouts is through something called a concierge service, which is a very fancy name. But what that means is you are going to be putting books on hold and picking them up with your families in our Skaggs front loop. So let's talk about how we're going to do that. First of all, how do you know what book you should check out? Here are some ideas for how you can pick out books. Number one is you can go to my YouTube channel playlist called Book Trailers and you can um, watch me talk about different books. I'll make recommendations. I'll explain what the book's about and that can help you choose what book you're interested in. Another option is you can go to the Google Classroom my Google Classroom, and I'm going to post different videos and posters that are, if you like this book, then you can read this book. So you may remember I have some of these posters in the library. I have one for Harry Potter, where I give you recommendation, recommendations if you like Harry Potter, one about Diary of a Wimpy Kid. So I'll be making more of these for you to help select books. And the last option, well, not last option, but another option is to ask your friends and ask me. So if you would like to email me or message me and ask me for a book recommendation, then I would definitely love to help you out. So once you have selected your book, then you are going to need to put your book on hold. So I have created a video for you on how to put books on hold on Koha. I will be posting this on YouTube on Google Classroom, and it is in this presentation if you are viewing this right here. So you're going to go to Koha, put your book on hold, and when your book is ready, you will be able to see on your screen on Koha that it is ready for pickup. Everyone is going to have to be checking their Koha accounts to see if their books are ready. That is the only way you know if your books are ready to pick up. You are going to go to Koha, it's explained in this video, and you are going to check your account to see if your books are ready to pick up. Remember that when you put books on hold, everybody else is doing that too. So if there's a really popular book like a new Diary of a Wimpy Kid or a Harry Potter book or a Babysitter's Club, it might be a long time before the book is ready for you because you can keep a book for a week or two weeks. And then I have to keep the books quarantined for three days before I can check them back in to make sure all the germs are gone to keep you safe. So check your Koha account to see when your books are ready. So how do you pick up your books? Once you've checked your account and you see you have books ready to pick up, these are your instructions. You are gonna pick one of the three times to come pick them up. I will be outside with all the books on Monday at 4 p.m., Wednesday at 9 a.m., and Friday at 12 p.m. So three different days and three different times. And you will come to the school, pull up into the front loop. Any books that you wanna return, you put them in your trunk. When you pull up in the loop, you need to pop your trunk open hold up your name tag with the names of every student you want to pick up books for. That means if you have siblings, you're going to hold up both names so I know which grade you're in and which students I'm, pick I'm getting books for. Then you're going to wait for me, Miss Walker, to get the books, check them out to you, and place them in your trunk. When I close your trunk and give you a thumbs up, you are good to go and enjoy your books. And you are going to keep repeating this every time you want new books. So anytime you want a new book, you put them on hold and then you come and pick them up. So that is how we are going to be doing book checkouts this year until things get safe for us to come in the library.